Hello, my name is Patrick Jones, and today I will be presenting why we should reduce the use of ventilators. What is a ventilator? A ventilator is a machine that provides mechanical ventilation by moving air in and out of the lungs to deliver breath to a patient who is physically unable to breathe. Why, when are they used? People usually will need a ventilator when they are physically unable to breathe well enough to provide oxygen to the lungs and brain of the body. This includes when a person is in a car wreck, goes to surgery, and has lung disease. Are they harmful? The longer people are on ventilators, the more likely they are to suffer lung-related injuries. These injuries are caused by machine-assisted breathing. 40 to 50 percent of patients die after being put on a ventilator regardless of the illness. So yes, ventilators are harmful. What has been done so far? So far, Doctors have been putting people on ventilators too early, which increases the time someone is on a ventilator. This, in return, increases the odds of permanent lung damage, which could cause death. The solution. The solution to this problem is, not, is to not put people on ventilators. Well, unless it is the last resort, or only option. This way, people have better odds of healing on their own and not having lung damage from ventilators. We could hold classes or workshops to help doctors understand when they don't and do have to put a patient on a ventilator. This will help doctors and respiratory therapists determine when they should or shouldn't put someone on a ventilator. The feasibility of the solution is very simple. We need to use better judgment when we put someone on a ventilator. Only do so when it is the last resort. It costs no money, but just a class or workshop type of information, information session among experts like other doctors and respiratory therapists that could talk to each other and use each other's expertise to help determine when and when they shouldn't put people on, resp or on ventilators. Why is it important we try to avoid ventilators when possible? It is important because 64 of people put on ventilators are children. If 40 to 50 percent of people on ventilators die unrelated to the illness or why they are put on a ventilator in the first place, we are losing a big portion of the future generations to come. Call to action. Ventilators should be used as a last resort. We should not use ventilators as, a res as early anymore. We need to hold workshops, type meetings for medical experts so they can better understand when they should and shouldn't put someone on a ventilator. And a better ventilator practice will help save many children who are the future of this generation. And these are my references, references I used for this PowerPoint. And I hope that you have learned that ventilators are a very serious problem in the medical field and they are causing many people many problems to come. Thank you.